Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem, which is 2 power of x plus 4 power of x plus 8 power of x is equal to 14. To find the values of x from this equation. So in the first step, we'll start with this 2 power of x plus for 4 to have same base of 2, 4 is same as 2 power of 2, then bracket power of x plus 8 to have same base of 2, 8 is same as 2 power of 3, then bracket power of x is equal to 14. Then in next step, we make in this side to have same 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 exponent of 2 power of x. So it will be 2 power of x plus we take this power of x inside power of 3 outside power of 2 outside the bracket. So it will be 2 power of x bracket power of 2 outside the bracket. Then plus also in here we take power of x inside power of 3 outside the bracket. So it will be 2 power of x bracket power of 3 is equal to 14. Then from this side 2 power of x is common. So we let t is equal to 2 power of x. Then our equation will be t plus t square plus t power of 3 is equal to 14. Then we take 14 to the left side. So we start with this with the largest power according to the decreasing. So this t power of 3 plus t power of 2 plus t. Then this we take the in here to be minus 14 is equal to 0. Then from this cubic equation, we solve it by grouping and factorization. Then from here 14, the factors of 14 are the first factor is plus or minus 1, the second factor is plus or minus 2, and plus or minus 7, and plus or minus 14. So we'll start to test starting from the lowest factor going to the increasing. So when we start to test with t is equal to 1. So we substitute 1 in this position of t. So it will be 1 power of 3 is 1 plus 1 power of 2 is 1 plus 1 then minus 14 is it equal to 0? We know that uh, 1 plus 1 plus 1 is 3 3 minus 14 is equal to negative 11 whereas this is not equal to 0. So t is equal to 1 it does not satisfy our equation. Then we test for the value of t is equal to 2. So it will be 2 power of 3 is 8 plus 2 power of 2 is 4 plus 2 then minus 14 is equal to from 8 plus 4 is 12 12 plus 2 is 14 14 minus 14 is 0 so this 0 is equal to 0 so the value of t is equal to 2 satisfy our equation then we take 2 to the left side so it will be t minus 2 is equal to 0. Now from here t minus 2 is one of the factor of this cubic equation. So when we start by solving by solving this cubic equation by grouping and factorization. Starting with the, this t power 3 is divisible by is it can is divisible by this t. So we will write it t power 3. Then for this t power of 2 to be divisible by negative 2, we split so it will be t is equal to, for it to be divisible by negative 2, this t power of 3, t power of 2, so the t power of 2, it will be equal to 3 t square minus 2 t square. So this negative 2 t square is divisible by negative 2, so we start with this negative 2 t square then this plus 3 t square then in next step after already split this we deal with this t so t will be equal to from here t power of 3 minus 2 t square this is divisible by t minus 2 then in this middle group 
starting with 3t square. 3t square is divisible by t. Then for this to split to be divisible by negative 2, it will be this 3 times negative 2 is negative 6. So t, t will be equal to 7t minus 6t. So this we will start with this negative 6t, then this plus 7t. So after all the split this t, then we complete with this negative 14 is equal to 0. Then the next step in here in here t square is common so we take t square out of bracket this divided by this is t this divided by this is negative 2 bracket then in here 3 3t three is common so to be plus 3t we take out of bracket this divided by this is t this divided by this is negative 2 bracket then plus from here 7 is common we take out of bracket so this divided by this is t this divided by this is negative 2 bracket is equal to 0 then from our equation t minus 2 is common so we take t minus 2 out bracket out of bracket this divided by this is t square this divided by this is this plus 3t this divide by this is 7 so to be plus 7 bracket is equal to 0 then from here we have two solutions whereas first solution is t minus 2 is equal to 0 and the second solution is this t square plus 3t plus 7 is equal to 0 then to solve from here we take negative 2 to the right side it will be t is equal to 2 and so from this quadratic equation by quadratic formula whereas quadratic formula is t is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a so it will be t is equal to negative b is 3 plus or minus square root of b square it will be 3 square which is 9 minus 4 times a a is 1 times c c is 7 then over 2 times a a is 1 then it will be t is equal to negative 3 plus or minus square root of 9 from here negative 4 times 7 is negative 28 so 9 minus 28 it is negative 19 then over this time this is 2 so it will be t is equal to negative 3 plus or minus square root of negative 19 is same as square root of 19 then times square root of negative 1 is i over 2 so after all you get this value of t and this value of t we recall before we let that t is 2 power of x so from t is equal to 2 power of x then you compare these two equations so it will be 2 power of x is equal to 2 whereas 2 is same as 2 power of 1 now in here we have same base so we compare these powers then it will be x is equal to 1 so this is one of the value of x in this our problem and to solve from here to we'll also compare from t is equal to 2 power of x so we'll compare these two equations so it will be 2 power of x is equal to this negative 3 plus or minus square root of 19 times i over 2 then we apply log in both sides so it will be log of 2 power of x is equal to log of negative 3 plus or minus square root of 19 times i over 2 then bracket then this power of x will move to the base so it will be x 
times log of 2 is equal to log of this negative 3 plus or minus square root of 19 times i then over 2 then we divide by log of 2 in both sides so this and this will cancel then it will be x well, we should write we should write in here x is equal to this log of 2 this 2 will move to here to the base so it will be log of this base of 2 so the value of x will be log of negative 3 plus or minus square root of 19 times i over 2 then bracket base of 2 so this is the other value of x which is the complex solution whereas in here we have two solutions because of plus or minus thank you for watching don't forget these steps to miss out subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video bye bye